I am brave. Second chance at life, and my life is a gift. I am thankful for Here at home, Roswell's Ribbons of Hope campaign kicked off during the Super Bowl. This special ad featured different cancer survivors with their hands painted different colors, making a ribbon shape with their hands to represent which cancer they survived. One of the people featured in it works right here with us at 7 Eyewitness News. This is Leslie Maloney. She's a cervical cancer survivor. It was wonderful to see her involved in that yesterday. And tonight, 7 Eyewitness News reporter Justin Moore introduces us to another cancer survivor also featured in that spot. His name is Victor Morales, and he is a multiple melanoma survivor. He shares with us why he decided to join this movement of hope. There is always hope. It's a commercial channeling a lot of hope. It's always exciting to be able to do something like that, especially something that means so much to you. Victor Morales is one of several cancer survivors featured in this Roswell Park ad that aired during the Super Bowl. I am stronger than you think. I am brave. The black and white commercial shows Roswell Park cancer survivors doing what they love while making a ribbon using their painted hands, their hands representing the color of their cancer. I think it's important to make sure that people know about cancers and that there's many different types of cancers. And the more people know, hopefully they'll help with the research um, to be able to save lives. Roswell Park CEO Dr. Candace Johnson says the hospital wanted to showcase a diverse group of survivors with different types of cancers. She says the overall message is hope. And you know, we're a sports community here and people watch the Super Bowl. And so it was a way for us to get our message out about hope and about how and, and peop, making people aware that they, they can survive this disease. There is always hope, no matter who you are or where you're from. Johnson says the Eagles might have won the game, but these Warriors won the fight. In Buffalo, Justin Moore, 7 Eyewitness News.